this part is where it gets ridiculous. Schweden Kreuz almost well, 160 miles per hour. 270 or so kilometers per hour then. here so we'll do take it easy Good morning comrades, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the Nürburgring Many many BMWs, but today it's namely about this BMW that you may know if you follow this man Luke from <laughs> Hampshire Photo YouTube channel or Hampshire Photography Instagram Whatever you want, whatever say, you want. Yeah. probably website as well and Facebook <laughs> and TikTok But he messaged me a few days ago saying like hey I'm coming to the Nürburgring, staying at Apex Would you like to do a lap in my car? To which I answered, you all know, it's <laughs> quite obvious what I answered. And it's not just a regular 140i, like pretty much every 140i that ends up on my channel. It is also pretty overpowered. Because, how many horsepower are we running? At the moment, the pump map, about 620, 620. 620 wheel? Brake. Brake, okay, yeah. brake horsepower. <laughs> so on the, on the, uh, watch out, don't scrape yourself. Watch yourself before you scrape yourself. <laughs> um, yeah, 620 brake horsepower, uh, but so on the crank, not on the wheels. Yeah, okay, okay, good. That's that's uh, that's good. That's good. That's kind of like uh, comforting. Um, <laughs> but what's interesting <laughs> for you is it's not X-Drive, obviously, because it's a UK yes. car, so it's all to the rear. Yeah, all to the rear, but you do have LSD. I do. Yeah, yeah. Very important because. Only handling mods. No, it's true, because in the past we already did a lap with, uh, I think two years ago by now, with a B58 140, also like 600 wheel horsepower, I think even, or 500 wheel horsepower, but no handling mods, no LSD, and it was just undrivable. Yeah, undrivable. What was the next drive? I don't remember, but we did plenty of this. Okay, so we do have, most importantly, for the track, we have different brakes. So big brake kit, yep. six pots, six pots, and uh, performance basically. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's on the front, and then they got upgraded discs and pads on the back. Okay. Um, Which pads are you running in the front? Oh, good question. Good DS question. Twenty five hundreds. Ah, good. Yeah. Good, 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 good. Usual. Upgraded, upgraded fluid and yeah, yeah um, lines. I can't all the important. Off the top of my head, what fluid it is? But I'm not sure if I mentioned the tires. Most obvious. Yeah. Mission and Pilot Sport 4S. And you will see later in the video that actually definitely needs some semi slicks. Yeah, but that's for next time. Well, and then for the rest, art, car, rap. Uh, How do you get the reference actually? Because normally people do. They just yeah. think that it's a random. No, it's a, it's a from a two series, right? From the from, the, the, it's arts, the original arts, art car. Yeah. So the from 1975. Yeah. Um, it was first done on a three liter CSL. Yeah. And then I because it's obviously a three liter. I mm -hmm. thought, why not? do it for the modern day which is why it's got chrome wheels and the bits and bobs like that but yeah yeah art car inspired exactly and in the back we have actually a methanol tank that we emptied already in two laps <laughs> yeah it's empty because as mentioned yes we already actually did two laps because since the track is only open for one hour today we decided we lap first we talk later so enjoy the video and i must say Due to technicalities, I've been running this GoPro for like over a year now in this condition that I don't run the door so I can swap batteries quite quickly. But it's the first time ever in two years that we were having so many jumps that the battery just got yeeted out. And um, yeah, the camera facing us will be dead after the jump of Schwedenkreuz. So it says a lot, just giving you some extra information. And at the end of the lap, we ran out of fuel. But um, yeah, that's a typical BMW thing, it then goes into limp mode. We limped it back here and now it's running. 
as it should as usual. So that's pretty much it and uh, one more thing of course we also did first lap we did for Luke's channel so if you want to see the actual first first lap check out his channel also video in the video description link down below all those things you know you know and uh, now really enjoy the lap okay so uh what do i do i put it in gear <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> regarding the settings that we're driving we'll be driving in sport plus because because sport plus is sport plus but we could also go for dsc off but we're not gonna do it because of this amount of power on rear wheels only mm, no, yeah. no. <laughs> big no we already even on warm tires on the first lap um, the car went kind of sideways through Verzeifen, which was controllable thanks to LSD, but um, yeah, makes no sense. It's not gonna add anything. So, ooh, some traffic jam here, here and there. But yeah, it's, it's nice. How long did it take you to build a car? So I've had it like two years. Okay. Two and a bit years. Um, but I've only just gone hybrid turbo on it, mm -hmm. um, literally a couple of days ago. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, but, uh, but yeah, it's been quite a gradual process. Um, so you didn't like buy it and immediately went, I want 600 plus horsepower. No, no, it's, <laughs> I went from stock to stage two and then stage two plus and yeah. then to what we are now. But all the other bits like the LSD, um, the visual side of things, because that's mm -hmm. a big part of it, I guess, as well. Yeah. It's all been fairly gradual. Mm. Exciting. Hope the brakes got enough cooling after our first lap. <laughs> <laughs> they were on fire. <laughs> they were a bit hot and the pedal is a bit soft so we yeah. had to take it easy through the first couple of bits to see if they would have some pressure. Okay, so we are going manual mode. Tap it once to put it in manual. And off we go. Almost. Adjusting the camera with this thing, while, uh, adjusting the mirror in this thing while driving the track. Mm. Spicy! <laughs>
soft so
<laughs> I can see my meth um, indicator flashing as well, so we've gone through like a whole tank of meth. Oh, nice. <laughs> well, we need to cool down anyway before we come up. When, when am I taking this out for I a lap? I've been out in it all day. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just not with you. Yeah, yeah, hmm, sad noises, sad noises. <laughs> but the video has been already published of us being in the Supra, etc. Yeah, uh, quick outro about this. Um, that's pretty much it. Uh, the car's here, all good, all back in one piece. Um, yeah, in the future, definitely needs, needs coilovers and definitely needs Cup 2 tires or any sort of semi slicks to actually really put the power down. The LSD is doing already a lot, and well, the lowering springs, hmm, hmm, hmm. yeah, well, they do something, but you need to have like proper, proper proper mods that fit the amount of horsepower to make it controllable, make it doable. But hopefully, yeah, in the nearby future we'll go out again and uh, go again for comparison. But uh, yeah, again, thank you very much, Luke, for this opportunity. And see you guys in upcoming video when, I don't know, we're gonna lap something or we're gonna vlog something, we're gonna eat something or film something. Something, something. Definitely something, something at the Nürburgring. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time. Bye.